All right, so I'm gonna show y'all how I made my kimono into a blouse. I'm gonna show you my full outfit for Memorial Day and how I made the blouse. So as you see, this is typically, I can put this over like a dress, over a swimsuit, over shorts and tank top. Just a nice little cover up so you're not showing everything. So I decided to put this over my white dress and make it look like my dress was a skirt and make this like a blouse. So for my mom had the slits in it. So I took the two and tied it together in the front. Covering up like an overlap so it makes it look like a nice blouse. I went ahead and double knotted it. So that's a nice little flowy, like a little bow look. And then I have a safety pin. Taking my safety pin and pinning my front together. Now it looks like you have a nice little v-neck. Looks like you have a nice bow. Now it's up to you. On the back end, you can either leave this out if you want to cover up your, your back area. Or for me, I went ahead and tucked it in to make it like a nice skirt and make this like a nice blouse. So, tucking that in. Now it looks like I have a nice blouse and a nice skirt. So that's how I made my Memorial Day outfit. I'm gonna show you the full outfit. And I have a video prior, if you go back and check that one, my video is gonna talk about wearing white before Memorial Day and wear a white after Labor Day. And that age old rule that we all went through, I know, back when we were younger and how times have changed. So comment below, let me know how you think about how I created this blouse. Have you done this before? Is this something new? Is this something like, oh, it's a good idea? Oh girl, yeah, I've already done that.